I'm here with Derek, he's the VP of Marketing for Rightwear. Derek, tell us a little bit about Rightwear and the Conzi platform. Uh, Rightwear is a software company. We're, we develop tools uh, for development of graphical user interfaces uh, for cars. We do focus on the automotive industry. Your company has a background in gaming. Can you describe that a little bit? Yeah, so our journey is kind of interesting. Um, we're actually born out of a series of spin-offs. Uh, there was a, a gaming company in, in Finland, which uh, is called Remedy Entertainment. They did Max Payne and uh, Alan Wake and a series of, of games most recently. Uh, they continue in their form. Uh, they spun off a company called Futuremark for uh, uh, graphics benchmarking. And, um, and we were spun off from Futuremark. So, um, you know, our, our core, um, our core competence and what really remains kind of in our DNA is high-performance graphics and um, then of course a, a workflow uh, to development, UI development uh, that comes from the gaming industry. Our Kanzi Studio uh, is really designed to put designers in the lead um, and like I said, this we, we, we have a role in our, in our workflow uh, that comes more from a gaming background called the technical designer. Uh, we put the technical designer in the middle of the process and really actually leading the process, um, supported by engineers uh, who, who bring the underlying glue code and, and the, the, the data sources and the application logic, and then the visual designers who come in with all the assets, who can be the creative lead in the development of user interfaces um, um, without having to write code, and can do early prototyping, rapid prototyping, um, uh, export, fully functioning code and uh, get it on the target hardware and uh, see the changes immediately. Very cool. Um, so drilling down into Kanzi as a platform, you have a couple of different product families in there. Can you talk about the different uh, options that you have? Sure. The other part, the, the matching component, is the runtime. That's the, it's called Kanzi Runtime, and that's the actual graphics engine, the UI, the, 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 the actual uh, runtime for the application, the resulting UI application. Um, that's where the graphics performance happens, and, um, and that's again the environment in which the engineers work at, in C++, right? So um, that's kind of the UI. Uh, we have a, a complementary product, which um, we're just uh, on the verge of, of, of hitting 1.0 uh, with Kanzi Connect. It's been in public beta since the beginning of the year. And this is a connectivity, uh, connectivity SDK, connectivity platform, uh, which has, uh, does a whole lot of different things, but, but fundamentally it'll bring any data and any service you know, onto any display. Right. So whether the data comes from a cloud service, whether the data comes from a neighboring uh, a, a compute platform in the car or from your smartphone or, or an app, I mean any data and any service onto any display. So we can make really holistic user experiences across the cockpit uh, and really simplify the integration of these um, cloud-based services, uh, for example. So. The inside of the car, hardware-wise, is changing a lot. You're seeing a lot of cars each year. The screen real estate is just increasing. So how does Kanzi accommodate for maybe even new ways that the in-car experience will have new screen space? Uh, indeed, uh, the screen real estate is growing uh, in cars as displays get uh, less expensive and the processing power to drive those displays uh, increases. Um, one of the things that we see then in, in the trends in interior design is that whereas one used to design around the displays, now as, as the content and services are moving onto those displays, from a holistic interior design perspective, you have to design for the displays and on the displays instead of just around the displays. So we worked with Qualcomm for CES uh, this year, or, uh, actually developed with the same concept that I just described around Kanzi for Android. So the, those were both, in that case, both Android, uh, two Android operating systems tied together with Kanzi Connect. Mm -hmm. We helped them bring in all the services from Alexa and Amazon Music and Video and, and Mapbox data on the back end, right. the cellular Vita X and the 5G connectivity, and, and, um, and then render that in a way that was consistent across both of the right. displays, all powered with Kanzi on, on the graphics side as well as the connectivity side, and that's a great example of Kanzi Maps brought in to that same solution as well. Awesome. Well, Derek, it was really interesting to learn more about Rightware, and uh, thanks so much for your time. Thank you. Ooh.